All right, man. I got to go in, man, on Ryan Garcia, bro. Ryan Garcia is pretending like he was trolling trolling people during the whole build up of Devin Haney. Ryan, you was not trolling, bro. You really was having mental issues, man. Stop acting like just because you beat Devin Haney with that left hook. Just because Devin Haney lost to you. I mean, I give I give you credit, Ryan Garcia. I give you credit, bro, for winning that fight. You did not think you was going to win whatsoever. You was playing funeral music in your dressing room. You cried before the fight. I saw the puff under your eyes. You was thank you was praying to Jesus the whole night, bro. You came out in that ring walk like it like it was a death walk, bro. Stop it. Stop acting like you was trolling the whole time. Stop acting like you don't have a twitch. That twitch is real. You really do have a twitch. You really was drinking. You really was having anxiety. You really was having mental issues. Man, quit it. I, I really want you to fight Boost Ennis. I think that's a good fight, Ryan. Make that fight happen, Ryan. Fight Boost Ennis, bro. <laughs> yeah, you call Boost Ennis out. Yeah, you, you probably can beat him. I mean, to be honest with you, you beat Devin Haney with a left hook, and that's it. I'm just keeping it 100. And Devin Haney feels even 100 times worse because he lost to a mental patient. Devin Haney, how the hell you lost to a mental patient, bro? They about to put, they was about to put Ryan on the fifth floor. And you lost to a mental patient. But see, now that Ryan won, now he went from anxiety being a mental case to being, what you call it, delusional. <laughs> he went from being a mental patient with anxiety to now being super delusional. Delusionally confident. <laughs> now Ryan Garcia, he's still a mental patient. He's just delusionally confident now. <laughs> yeah, ain't that changed? And the boy's still crazy. It just helped his. his it, it just boosted his self esteem. He got, he got a boost in self esteem now, but he's still delusional. But he got a boost, and you can tell he's delusional. He, he's calling out Boost Ennis. He's calling out. I'm surprised he ain't called out Canelo yet. The man calling out uh, Anthony Joshua, talking about when he gonna go up and wait and fight Anthony Joshua. Come on, bro. Take several seats. This dude still crazy. Ron is a mental case. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if this win was good or bad for him. He gonna get himself. Well, he gonna find out. He gonna find out. Devin Haney, you lost to a mental patient, bro. You you definitely dropped the ball. Dropped the ball. But I do still got to give Ron Garcia uh, some respect now. That left hook lands on you. He can knock anybody out with that left hook. Probably. He probably can knock anybody out with that damn left hook. He is Iron Fist Ryan Garcia. Don't get it twisted. He is Iron Fist Garcia. You know what I'm saying? But uh, Devin Haney chin was already suspect anyway. So he sh Devin Haney was delusional his damn self. He he was just uh, underrating. He, he really just was over. Devin Haney was overconfident his damn self. Delusional his damn self. Underestimating Ryan his damn self. Thought it was going to be an easy win his damn self. So, who was the bigger mental patient? Devin Haney or Ryan Garcia? Devin Haney should have knew better. Devin Haney ain't, you know, Dev, I don't think Devin Haney was training all that hard either. You know what I'm saying? Oh, it's going to be an easy win. You know, Ryan Garcia is a C-plus fighter. Yeah, you took all, you said all that shit. You probably didn't even train hard, Devin Haney.
and look what happened. Embarrassed. I think he's more embarrassed than hurt. That's why he was getting up like that. The dude was embarrassed, man. It wasn't about no heart. It was about nigga just got in back. Nigga just was embarrassed. He was super embarrassed, bro. Like this was supposed to be his Arturo Gotti fight. You know what I mean? You know, they they try to copy Floyd to a, you know, all that. He, and, and Floyd Mayweather Sr. instilled that in Devin Haney. He, you just like Floyd. You just like Floyd. And Devin Haney started to believe his own bullshit. That's what happened with Devin Haney. He started, he started to uh, believe the hype. Then his dad is super hyping him up. Putting a battery in his back. With his weird antics. Bill Haney, you too. Bill Haney a weirdo too. He act like a clown. I, I went to Bill Haney Instagram. He acting like he's a WWE wrestler, bro. He's but bro dumb. I guess he think I guess he think fans are dumb or something, so he gotta act like a clown, act like a you know, a fake ass wrestler to appeal to these dumbass fans. But boxing fans, I think he's trying to appeal to the casuals. But these casuals are not buying them. These are the casuals you trying to appeal to is kids, bro. Like you acting like a kid. Bill Haney was acting acting like a kid, man. In these in these little videos, he be he be making himself look stupid. You know what I'm saying? Putting on that weird ass character he be putting on. With that weird, with them weird glazing it, with that weird glazing his eyes, with them super white teeth and smiling, dude, a weirdo. You know what I'm saying, dude, a weirdo. Just act regular, Bill. Just act normal, bro. What, what are you doing? You acting like a, a five year old, bro. You look stupid. It, it's like it's like Bill Haney acting like Ho Hogan. What are you going to do, Ryan Garcia, when Devin Haney comes for you? Don't nobody want to see you act like that, Bill Haney. You look stupid. <laughs> You're not appealing to 8-year-olds on Saturday mornings, bro. Stop acting like that. You look stupid, bro. And grown folks don't want to see that. Just act normal. I'm not amused. I, I, I tell you that. I'm definitely not amused to... To the characters Bill Haney be trying to portray. I'm not amused. He looks. I already said. Well, you know. He looks stupid bro. But. Anyway. Devin Haney just felt. Embarrassed. That's how why he kept getting up. Because he lost to a mental patient. Ryan Garcia didn't think he was going to win. Was full of anxiety. And when he hit. Devin Haney. With that first shot. He was shocked his damn self. Ryan was like, oh shit, I got a shot. I just rocked this motherfucker. Wow, I didn't know I had, I didn't know. Oh, now I'm confident. Oh, I can really, I can really beat this guy. You know, that's how Ryan Garcia mentality was. Oh, damn, I can really beat you? Oh shit. <laughs> and that's why Ryan Garcia is full of, is full of himself now. You know what I mean? I I just beat the undisputed world heavyweight champion, man. I can do anything. You know what I'm saying? Now I want to fight Bruce Ennis. <laughs> if I can beat Devin Haney, I can beat anybody. You know what I mean? So yeah, go ahead and uh fight uh Boost Ennis, Ryan. I wanna see that fight. Like I said, you do have a puncher's chance. I give you that. But your skills are trash. As I'm watching this Devin Haney fight. But I'm gonna tell you another thing that, that that's working for uh Ryan Garcia. That shoulder roll is really working for him. You know what I'm saying? It's really working for him, but I, I I feel that the referee gonna stop that crap in the future. But it's working for him right now, and 
I don't think nobody can can hit him when he when he goes up in that in that shoulder roll like that. But they going the ref got to start, you know. The ref going got the ref has to start taking points from him doing that, you know, in the future. Cuz that's illegal to turn your back like that. Come on, bro, you can't do that. But anyway, that's it for me, man. Shout out to Ryan Garcia. I like I like Ryan. Ryan, Ryan funny to me, but uh, I don't think it was an act. You know, like I said, he, he was really mentally not there. I mean, he was really mentally somewhere else. He didn't help the fight. He didn't help sell the fight. So why was he doing that? He, you know, he went fooling nobody. Well, he maybe he didn't fool uh, Bill. He probably he fo- he maybe fooled uh, Devin. He fooled Devin, but he didn't fool Bill. That's it, man. Peace.